I wanted to show you something really quick. Hold, please. Uh-huh. Oh! Right? <laughs> okay, St. Lucy, pop those eyeballs back in, because I want to explain. This is St. John the Divine, located in medieval New York, and I knew them vaguely as this big, beautiful Gothic Revival Episcopal Cathedral. And then I recently learned that St. John's was having a Pride celebration, and I was like, a church that looks like this, with the soaring stone gothic arches, is having a pride event. I must make pilgrimage. My friends and I arrived, and they were playing Shania Twain, and there was an open bar in the nave, which I thought was eerily similar to the conversion of St. Paul. If you listen closely, you can hear St. Shania. Also at this event was a beautiful art exhibit by the artist Gabriel Garcia Roman from a series entitled Queer Icons, which was absolutely exquisite to see in person. The cathedral also has a Keith Haring altarpiece in a side chapel with student artwork inspired by it, which I loved. The moment for me though was the illumination of the church where the dean said some really powerful words about the Episcopal Church's commitment to welcoming and protecting the LGBT plus community. Oh. And as someone who has spent an ungodly amount of time listening to religious leaders of other faiths express the exact opposite sentiment, or really in my case, just ignore the queer community as a whole because they didn't exist where we lived in theory, it meant the world to me to hear those words in a space that looked like this. Like my peasant brain is still trying to take that in, in a good way. And speaking of this space, we are going to do at least one more video just talking about this beautiful building. It's one of the largest cathedrals in the world. This is a tassel for some foreshadowing. And really, I have been bearing the lead because I went on a tour of the textile lab, which is right next to the cathedral in an old orphanage. And it was an incredible experience. It puts the divine and St. John the, and I'm going to tell you all about it in another video. So thank you, St. John's, for the invite. It was a free event, this Pride celebration. Everyone was welcome. I just need a little push sometimes, so I really appreciate it. 